Last on my list to talk about when it comes to XDA and XDA etiquette and uh, understanding how XDA works is uh, titles and uh, and these uh, sidebars of uh, of different users. So I'm here. I'm looking at uh, a USU patch kernel versions for uh, the LG G4, and in particular, uh, I'm not so much focusing on what the thread's about, but rather on the uh, people on the sidebar of the thread. So in this case, uh, this thread was made by uh, Steadfaster X, and uh, who is a brilliant. Uh, brilliant developer here on XDA. I have only good things to say about this person. But uh, notice that this person here has a title of recognized developer. And you've probably noticed as you're going around on XDA that there's different titles that people have. If we scroll through here, we'll see um, that uh, this user here is a senior member. Okay. And uh, in that this user is a recognized developer. Okay. Um, obviously, uh, you know, clothes don't uh, clothes don't make the man is how the saying goes. But uh, that these titles are given to people um, for different reasons. So if you're just getting started, yours is probably says something to the effect of, um, you know, junior member, uh, and typically to go from junior member to senior member, I believe it's one year or a certain number of posts. I can't remember for sure. Uh, and then, oh, this is interesting. Account currently disabled is the status. That's not uh, not exactly a high calling of, of good uh, <laughs> of good account status there. But you'll notice that uh, everybody also has things in their in their sidebar about like the number of posts they've made and then their thanks meter. And the thanks meter is this yellow bar here that uh, equivalates, uh, equates to 6 out of 20 notches on our thanks meter for 758 thanks to, uh, to this user in particular. And then, for instance, we have Steadfaster X who has uh, 9,328 thanks and it equivalates to 9 out of 20 notches on our thanks meter bar here. Um, and what I want to point out is that this isn't quite like leveling up in a video game in that your thanks meter does not continue to grow and then suddenly you become something like a recognized developer or a recognized contributor or a recognized themer or whatever the case may be. These, uh, these thanks buttons go up by obviously by people hitting the thanks button. So you say uh, you say something useful that's helpful to other users and uh, for instance in this case uh, Steadfaster X said something uh, useful to try to help someone out here and these two people decided to slap the thanks button because this information was useful or helpful to them or helpful in general and they just felt that it was worthy of a, of a thanks button slap and uh, we've talked about that previously on, on about how we do thanks and that sort of thing but that just continues to make this bar grow but that doesn't necessarily give them a title so this bar could max out and they still would only be a senior member um, the difference is in the uh, XDA recognized developer program and and this is just a uh, old article of how they expanded the program here uh, but if you just search in the bar for recognized developer uh, several things will pop up but this is one of them and I just want to grab this just to show you uh, that uh, you can apply to become a recognized developer a recognized contributor or recognized themer um, as well as uh, a senior recognized developer and these uh, these titles and these sort of things are something that you either apply for yourself or you can actually submit someone else to be applied for them uh, typically uh, you would want to read through the description and see that uh, there's there's some specific uh, guidelines that you have to follow um, for instance, to become a recognized developer is a title intended for users who produce 
some of the most innovative and original work in ROM kernel application development. As a recognized developer, it is expected that you will be producing and actively developing rather than cooking new works. So you'll hear this phrase cooking. Um, typically that's the kind of work that I do is cooking. Like I'm just making ROMs. I'm just building ROMs. I'm not uh, I'm not going out there and making new material for making new ROMs, if that makes sense. I'm I'm just building ROMs for phones, uh, expanding the amount of available phones to different uh, to different ROMs and that sort of thing, um, and that's called cooking. When you when you make ROMs all the time, you're just you're cooking. Uh, and a recognized developer, in theory, is also cooking, but they're they're doing uh, like either cutting edge work, they're uh, building ROMs for phones that have never been built before, and they're um, building material working from scratch. And there's no other phone to borrow from. They're they're just having to make it up from nothing. Uh, that's that's kind of the goal of the recognized developer and then you know you can even step up to senior recognized developer um, which was just a special status uh, but for instance so if, if you felt you were uh, worthy of being a recognized developer or if you felt someone else was worthy of being that you could click on uh, this and fill out the form um, but also for themers for instance people who uh, who design uh, theme graphics, user interfaces, and overhauls for ROMs? Uh, this themer is kind of going away in a bit, or in a kind of shrinking in its uh, its ability to be used because now with later versions of Android, um, themes can be applied a lot differently because of layers and RRO and um, the different methods that we have available now. Um, but back in the day, uh, you know, Android, uh, oh, ice cream sandwich and below for sure, uh, that themers would actually take a ROM and have to manually change the colors of the title bars and all of that sort of thing. And so you could be a recognized themer. Um, and, uh, and it tells you here uh, who you can talk to and who can um, add that. And then you have kind of the lowest level which is recognized contributor. Uh, it's for people who make, uh, who contribute. They um, uh, typically role intended for members who produce some of the best original or helpful guides for users as well as helping other users who have problems. So this doesn't necessarily mean that you even make ROMs. If, if, you're, uh, if you're doing material that helps other people, you can, uh, you can apply to be a recognized contributor yourself or you can uh, submit other people um, by contacting them. And so, for instance, like uh, the recognized developer, if you clicked here to uh, you know, sign yourself up for that, uh, then you would fill out this recognized developer application form and it has some information that you have to fill in and you fill that out and send that in and uh, you can apply to be a recognized developer. Um, when is a good time to do that? If you don't, if you have to ask the question of when's a good time to do that, you're probably not ready yet, is, is my guess. Um, but uh, it's just uh, something that you can uh, apply for uh, when you when you feel that you're ready for those, or if you feel that someone else is ready for that, you can uh, you can apply them for that as well. So, for instance, in the case of Steadfaster X, making uh, kernel patches and kernel versions, so that way they can um, uh, do some really incredible things, um, unlocking uh, locked phones by using some of his material here and just uh, some of the great work that he's done to make uh, for instance salt one of his uh, tools that I cover in a video for being able to uh, just work with the um, LG G4 and be able to uh, you know completely back up the whole system flash and, and move some stuff around really an impressive and incredible work and so definitely worthy of being a recognized developer uh, and, and so has uh, garnered that title. But just wanted to cover uh, that as you're looking around on XDA you're going to see people that have a couple different titles 
and that's how they got those titles either either someone else submitted them or they submitted themselves or uh, the case as it may be but I wanted to clarify that it is not based on the thanks meter the thanks meter will continue to grow as people slap your thanks button but that does not uh, for instance quote level you up to different levels of of uh, developer so just wanted to cover that as we uh, wrap up this series on XDA and XDA etiquette.